one, we are playing some more Mafia 2, the Definitive Edition. We are up to part three of this Let's Play, I guess, walkthrough gameplay, whatever you want to call it. It has been a couple of, couple of days now since I have played this, so please bear with me. I might have forgotten a couple of things. I've been playing, um, what other games have I been playing? Some Gears Tactics, a lot of Halo, um, and all that sort of good stuff. I am uh, thinking of doing kind of a uh, kind of a let's play fun episode, I guess. Not really a let's play, just a fun episode of, of Halo 3. Just online. See how we go. I've got Call of Duty downloading as well. Play some Call of Duty. I haven't played... I haven't played um, that new game mode yet. I, I've completely gone blank. I've, com I've completely uh, gone blank on what on what that game mode's called. Warzone. Is it Warzone? Yeah, I think it's Warzone. End of the phone. All right. Joe's pleasure, pal. It's Vito speaking. Vito, why didn't you come home last night? I was worried sick. Mama? I didn't know you had Joe's number. And whose phone is this? So have you spoken to Mr. Papalardo? Find yourself a job? Yeah, he told me to come by and see him today. Hopefully he's got some work for me. Okay, Vito. Good luck, mio bambino. All right, bye, Mama. Go to the Southport docks and see Mr. Papalardo. A change of clothes, okay. Find them in the wardrobe. Is this the wardrobe? I think it is. It's flashing. What do we want to look like today? In a suit? I guess in a tuxedo. Suit and glasses. Oh, that's the 2k. Oh, that's the 2k account reward since I created an account with them. We got a tuxedo. Oh, we have suit. We'll, we'll go suit and sunglasses. A bit more professional, you know? I, I might get... I might get I might be able to get the job even though we're literally playing mafia. Oh, uh, hi there. What's the matter? Nothing good on the radio. Nothing good on the radio. Eh? You don't turn that crap down. I'm going to call the cops. I think you just need to calm down a bit there, bud. Get your car. Whoa, those texture pop it. Did you did you guys sit there? Wait, why do we have so many cars? Wait, am I <laughs> Am I We didn't have this many cars last time, did we? Are these the 2k reward cars? Alright guys. For the next episode, what car do you want? Do you want the Cossack, the Rology or 300, the Samson Drifter? Or we can just drive around the, the uh, beat up Jefferson if you want. We'll go with the Samson Drifter. Oh boy. I think it's B, isn't it? Yeah, it's B. Hey, how do you do 40 up them in here? I think there's actually a setting within the game. Driving mode. New simulation. Is there... I don't think there is. I think it could be later on. I'm not, I'm not entirely too sure, actually. I could, I could be the radio for you guys. I'll, I could go ahead and sing. I'm just kidding. Okay, let's, yeah, 
let's just turn it back on. Yeah, the Empire Central, there we go. It's so funny, with, with the music in the games, I received probably about 20 emails just for the one episode, um, talking about how it how it breaks the um, terms and conditions simply because of the uh, monetization stuff. And obviously I can't even monetize videos anyway, because you do have to have that specific, um, yeah, I think it's a thousand views, a thousand views and like a thousand subscribers or something like that. Oh. But yeah, it doesn't really matter anyway. Alright, here we go, here's the dock. So yeah, so this is where Vito's father actually worked, I believe. I think. Don't quote me. But I'm pretty sure. So it was down at the dock anyway. Is that really the damage that that post did? Jeez. I think it's A to take cover. Is it LB to jump? That's some clumpy steak you're eating there, bud. Typical, reading the Playboy. Oh, close the door, it's windy. What do you want? Uh, yeah, I'm looking for a Mr. Papalotto. Oh, yeah? Why? My name's Vito Scaletta. My old man used to work for him, and I'm looking for a job, so I came here. Well, you're in the right spot, sonny boy. Federico Papayato at your service. You can call me Derek. I think I remember your dad. Good guy, but drank like a fish. What's he up to these days? He's dead. Oh, well... We all gotta go sometime. Right, Steve? Sure, Derek. So you need a job, huh? Well, you're in luck. We just got a new shipment to unload. Steve will show you around. Now scram, my steak's getting cold. Uh, follow me. Alright. I don't know, I kinda, I, I don't really like the sunnies on Vito, because it, I don't know, in cutscenes it kinda looks a bit weird. I might change that, when I go to, um, when I go to the closet next. But, look, I made that much of a good impression, you know, I, I've already got a job, I have to unload. I kinda see that as a bit of a win. I load this pile of crates onto that truck, when you're done you get ten bucks. If something gets lost or broken, you get nothing. Start now and don't take all day. Okay. I think we should be... Should be okay. Alright, okay, so X to lift the crate. Alright, so we can't break anything, otherwise we won't get paid. Even though I've got... How much? 320. So what, back in the day, 10 bucks a day, eh? That's kind of crappy. Oh, jeez. That, that locked into place. <laughs> that really locked into place. Oh, yeah, this is going to be a lot of fun. Who the fuck wants to move boxes around all goddamn day? But to be fair, there's actually not that much there. 10 bucks for that, that's... That's pretty good. That should only be like... An hour's worth of work? Not even that. Look at those, lock in place. The door is open, leave when you have had enough. I don't know, should we... Is there, is there an achievement to just kind of like... Keep doing it? Alright, I, I, need, I need to check this out. Chapter 3... There's a lot of, uh, complete the chapters. Finish the story, medium difficulty, hard difficulty. Okay. Maybe I should have probably played this on the hardest difficulty. Uh, travel 125. Sell five vehicles, sell five vehicles. Give any vehicle at 30. 
rob five stores in five minutes. So yeah, so normally after after I complete the story missions, I do mop up the trophies afterwards. I am a bit of an achievement hunter, or trophy hunter, because I do play PlayStation as well. And I've got more Platinums on there than I do here anyway. Find all the Playboy magazines. And then, are these the secrets? Yeah, okay. I don't, I don't think it will be. It shouldn't be one of them, right? If so, we can just come back. Hey, you done? Yeah, I'm done. And you can keep the ten bucks. When I said I needed a job, I didn't mean slave labor. Whatever. Get the fuck out of here, then. Don't show your face around here again. Yeah, don't worry. I can make a hundred times more working for Barbaro Incorporated. Wait, you said Barbaro? Joe Barbaro? Yeah, so what? Shit. Nobody who works with Joe would carry crates for ten bucks. What the hell are you doing? Come with me. Alright. Well, at least, at least Joe has made a name for himself. I mean, obviously not for the wrong, for the good reasons, I guess. And I'm pretty sure this is where you pick up the first Playboy ma Oh, the first Playboy mag was right what there. What now? Well, this one don't like manual labor. What the fuck? Said he works with Joe Barbaro. Bullshit. Who want to load crates if he works with Joe? You'll have to explain this one to me, sonny boy. What's your story? Uh, well, my mother wanted me to come talk to you about an honest job, but I need some real money, so this ain't gonna cut it. <laughs> Them women. They're all the same. Right, Steve? Sure, Derek. She doesn't want you hanging around with Joe, right? <laughs> my mother was the same way. Look what become of me. Union boss. I got the whole fucking waterfront under my thumb. So how's Joe? Pretty good, I guess. How'd you meet up with him? Oh, we go way back to the old neighborhood. I just come back from overseas and he's putting me up until I can get back on my feet. Listen, uh, you gotta understand, a person in my position has gotta be careful. Certainly. So you won't mind if I give Joe a call, right? Nah, go ahead. Now, where'd I put his number? Hey, here it is. Might not be home. That wouldn't be good. Hi, Joe. Hey, this is Derek. Listen, I got this guy here. Uh, what'd you say your name was? Vito. Vito. He's looking for a job. He says he's a friend of yours. A good friend. I just wanted to check with you first. Uh-huh. Sure. War hero and all that shit. All right, all right. Thanks, then. I'll talk to you later. Sorry, pal. I had to check you out. Joe says you just come back from Italy. You must be able to handle yourself. You want to make a little more money? I got just the thing. The guys here at the port are supposed to pay a monthly fee to the barber, but half of them never cough it up. I need someone to give him a little uh, what much. are you chopping there, buddy? Ten bucks a man. What if they don't need a haircut? Well, then you'll have to convince them otherwise. I see. What if somebody makes a fuss? Then you kick the shit out of them. Well, let's say you teach them a lesson that doesn't require that they miss work. You got it? Which is why Steve ain't doing the job. Right, Steve? Right, right boss. boss. Collect at least 150 I was bucks. I expect you to say right, Derek. Just for walking around, taking it into Sierra, meeting new people. Easy fucking money, eh? What do you say? Yeah, hey, it's better than lugging crates around. All right, then. Get going. All right, where's that Playboy magazine he was reading? I, I, I know that there's one just there. Dokie. 
It was down here, right? Yeah. Wait. Collect Eric's fee from the do yeah from the dock workers. <clears throat> I'm here to collect the fee for the barber. You've got the wrong guy, pal. My wife cuts my hair. Yeah, that's sweet. But while you work here, you get a haircut when Derek says. Ugh! Okay, okay, enough already. Here's your fucking money. Yeah, glad you decided to reconsider. It's not very nice to bully there, Vito. Hey, pal. Derek needs you to pay the fee for the barber. I was just coming to pay. Actually, he's pretty good barber. Next time, try to pay on time, okay? Thanks. Hey, Derek needs you to pay the fee for the barber. Again? I don't even go to the damn barber. Here, you give it to the Robin son of a bitch. Don't leave it until the last minute next time. <laughs> Poor guys. Hey, pal. Derek needs you to pay the fee for the barber. Look, asshole, I'm not in the mood. Why don't you get out of my face before you get hurt? Ah, no can do, pal. Derek wants his money. Derek can kiss my ass. What's that fat fuck gonna do? Have me killed? Hey, you said it, not me. Why don't you give it a try then, asshole? Whoop his ass! <laughs> I'll hold the dodge. There's a lot of hits. Oh, right here. Good to thing, uh, good thing to know that I can actually hold it. Hold A to dodge, I had no idea about that. Kick the shite out of him! There we go. Okay. Anybody else got a fucking problem with paying for the fucking barber? Uh, Vito, I'd like for you to calm down, please. Here's the money, boss man. Good job. Here's your share. I watched you take care of Bill. You were good. Steve damn near got his ass kicked when he tried that. Right, Steve? Yeah, right, Derek. Here's a bonus for sorting him out. Thanks. The guy's been a real fucking pain. Now get out of here, kid. I gotta be getting back to business. Hey, say hello to your mother for me. Tell her you got yourself a job as my new assistant. Yeah, will do. I'll see you later. Hey, Vito. I almost forgot. Joe called. He wants you should meet him at Freddy's. Alright. But anyway, guys. That's going to be it for this episode. If you enjoyed, like, subscribe, hit the notification bell for the upcoming gameplays. Uh, but yeah, guys. I'll go ahead and put down my PSN and my gamer tag in the description below. Feel free to send me a message. Uh, you know feel free to send me a friend request any of that i'll accept we can play some games together have have some fun but yeah guys hope to see you in the next one take care